Well, we're here at Rab's barbecuing again. People seem to like our uh, last barbecue video, so I uh, thought we'd film one again. Got some nice uh, seasoned burgers here ready to eat. People were asking what kind of grill Rob had last time. It's uh, Royal Gourmet. Where'd you get it, Rob? Online? I got it from uh, Amazon, actually. Amazon? Yeah. yeah. Really got it off of Amazon. One of the better rated ones. Yeah? Yeah. It's pretty nice. Hey, uh, it's more in my style of cooking. Yeah, I like that. Steaks always come out really nice on these things. Put a little butter on there too after you flip it and uh, drench the steak with butter. Oh, oh, yeah. Well, we'll come back uh, once this thing's preheated and uh, let you enjoy the experience. Here we go. Those are smelling pretty good, huh? flowers over here. Trying to, not real <laughs> green thumb here. <laughs> in the sun there, Mac? <laughs> I've got pretty fair skin, the sun's not my friend. Some call me the day walker. <laughs> <laughs> Mine looks sad compared to Steph's. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's just a beautiful day. It's about 80 degrees right now.
cabin in the bird bath over there. Max, my Magi chilling in here right now, having a bone while we're barbecuing. Rob just picked up some eggs for the burgers. Yeah, I've been making those a fried egg lately. They've been coming out really good. You leave the uh, yolk runny, and then after you make the burger, you squish it, and it just runs all over the burger like a sauce. Oh. Took mine a little extra. Oh, so good, rather. Hard to go wrong. Yeah. Yep. I wouldn't mind having a stove that. Have you ever seen the stoves that have these range tops on them? Yep. Yeah, if I ever had my, like, Ideal made up a batch of my gargoyle beans. Uh, they're made with uh, maple and bacon flavored uh, baked beans with uh, a big dollop of mustard, uh, uh, ketchup, uh, brown sugar, and then uh, I put a lot of cayenne and other spices in it uh, and some pretty spicy chorizo. It's uh, very good. They go good with just about anything on the grill. Right. <laughs> Got it off of Amazon. Do they sell smaller size ones too? Yep. Really? Yep. Yeah, I could. You can get them. You can get them this big. Really? See, that's yep. what I. That's what I could probably yep. do at my house with something something small like this. That's all I really need. Oh, nice. Aren't they cute? Yes, they are. Yeah. You bringing one of those home? You said. Oh, yeah. nice. We always make out like a baby here. <laughs> Thanks, Steph. Thank you, Tammy, for helping me. You're like a dirt on my face. <laughs> I got my face. Not yet. <laughs> After you eat the burger, you will.
beautiful day. Oh, right here, Steph. <laughs> you got about 80 degrees, slight breeze in the air. Really nice. Oh, you made onion rings? I made onion rings, but I tried to copy the Burger King. <laughs> Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Nice. Did it come out good? Tastes good. Really? Nice. Onion rings are good on burgers, too. Mm -hmm. I think I'll slap, a, slap one on there. Onion ring and egg. Well, at least you don't have any monster with bacon that's a little bit longer. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, hopefully I don't get chastised in the comments again for having monster and bacon. Yeah, yeah. I was gonna die at 65 for drinking a monster. Yeah, that's what I say. That's my uniform. It's like it's like fake leather. Oh, sweet. Yeah, hot. So you just. Yeah. This is for you. <laughs> the guy that said I was gonna die for so, drinking monster. So you know you're there about 20. <laughs> Oh, you like gear you wear? You got a picture? Yeah. <laughs> That's Tammy. She works. Uh, she works in nursing. That's what she's stuck wearing at work. Yeah. <laughs> Call it pleather. <laughs> Awful fashion forward know, there. Right? <laughs> That's why I married you, because you're such a fashion maven. <laughs> Yeah, she's, uh, her face is breaking out because yeah. she has to wear a mask every day uh, at work. Well, I did some apple cider vinegar on it. It's, it's, I mean, it's like red and yeah. Especially now that it's getting hotter. You know those, like, um, Yeah. Like, yeah, it worked on, uh, yeah. Avi. Yeah, it worked yeah. on Avi. Yep. Rob said they saw some of these that are just, uh, like this size here, Tim. Yeah, we should get one like that. Yeah. That would be perfect. We wouldn't need one this big. Yeah, something small like that. Yeah. Or just you and me. I... No, well, <laughs> my neighbors don't ever come over, so <laughs> that's not an issue. They're intimidated by <laughs> I get along with all my neighbors, yeah. but uh, yeah. we don't barbecue together. <laughs> <laughs> Just don't put any sauce on you, Mikey. Right. I was uh, surprised that uh, I got such a big reception to that uh, uh, kettle cleaning video. I didn't think anybody would want to see that. Uh, glad you enjoyed it. Yeah. Royal Gourmet. Royal Gourmet is the uh, brand. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
to uh, carry uh, three large dogs at a time at the most. You can uh, see here I've got a cargo net off, off, off the back and the dogs riding there. So that's why you don't see all the dogs uh, together on my hikes. Oh, I'm going to clear my throat. I don't have COVID. <coughs> Excuse me. I had to bully the sheriff to show up. Is that what? I had to bully the sheriff to Did show up. Did you really? Yeah, I think he was like... Yeah, they're all getting pretty yeah. uniformed. That's what I thought there, compared to the last time I saw them. Yeah. But you know, usually, you know, the big size difference when they're first born uh, just has to do with the puppy placement. It doesn't necessarily mean that, you know, puppies when they're first born, the big ones aren't necessarily going to be the biggest puppies later on. They just uh, sometimes have to be the puppy that had the best placement in the fetus and was uh, getting the most nutrients. Well, the one that was the biggest was the first one. Yeah, 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 so yeah, exactly. I'm happy to see that uh, Magi looks like she could be coming into heat. Uh, she's got a really nice male lined up. That's the breeding I'm really excited about. Uh, see what comes from that. So I'm definitely going to hang on to something from that. I think there's going to be some freaks in that litter. Yeah. At least it has the potential to produce some freaks. I mean that in a good way. As you look at him. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, they, uh, if uh, a couple pups come out of there that uh, take the best traits from both those dogs, I think those will be among some of the best dogs I've produced. You know, they just have to get the right combination of traits from them, each of them. That's what I love about uh, breeding and creating a new breed is kind of the uh, mad scientist aspect of it, the uh, interplay of genetics, uh, how dominant, recessive, and polygenic traits all come together and uh, you know produce different type of dogs. That's the most fun in some of this for me. Animals look good. The best part is they don't get dry. Yeah. No matter what. You can cook them for an hour and What did they have mixed in with them? <clears throat> they called it a Montreal blend. I, I, they there, don't, really, there, they don't give it, you they don't give you the Was there cheese mixed in with it? Nope. No. Just just seasoning? Yep. Yeah, those are thick. I got a new tattoo on the back of my neck, so I'm trying to avoid right. getting too much sun on it. Man, I'm uh, I'm pissed off they closed the Minnesota State Fair this year, huh? Right? Oh man. I'm pissed off. Really? The next move is going to be the Renaissance. Yeah, festival, yeah, I'm right? sure. I'm sure. Yeah. That's yeah. always uh, the highlight uh, of the end of the summer for me. Yeah. 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 We go there a couple times usually during but the day and at I night. I can have my tickets for next year, they said. <laughs> <laughs> I still get emails. I don't want to wait that long. Yeah, I still, I'm, I'm hoping that the Ren Fest doesn't, because this is supposed to be the last year that they're at that yeah. location. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah. Yeah, that'll really kind of put a. Put everything. a big damper in the whole summer. Those are a couple of our favorite summer things. That's where we get our cigars. Yeah. And our honey sticks. Oh, those are good. Yeah. Honey sticks. Yeah. Love them. Yeah. I like the cinnamon ones. 
but oh yeah yeah that's what I take uh, as a supplement is uh, a couple of uh, tablespoons of bee pollen every day uh, if you look it up uh, bee pollen supposedly one of the most complete nutritious foods on the planet it has uh, every uh, vitamin and nutrient that a uh, human needs for health you could live off of just pea, pea pollen and something for uh, fiber I really like really like it it's kind of like honey uh, depending on what the uh, bees were pollinating uh, the pollens can have uh, a lot different flavors Yeah, I'm gonna have to for sure pick up a smaller version of this thing. You know, I prefer cooking like this than on a barbecue, anyways. It's just more what I, more the style of cooking that I do. Stuff doesn't get all dried out. Nope. But like, if you're gonna do ribs, you need both. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> I can make pretty good ribs in my oven. Mm-hmm. Yep. I wanted to try one of those convection ovens. Yeah, yeah, I wouldn't mind having one of those. Ideally, uh, if I could set my kitchen up, I probably want to have both a convection and a normal oven. Do me a favor and cook one a little bit longer for me. Yep. Me and Tammy, she likes her to cook a lot. Yeah, those look good. <laughs> Sun with the eye in the clouds. She just burped. Oh, I was like, yeah. She's a lady. Let's come out for a second, sir. She's like, I smell something good. Yeah, you can see out in the sun, she's kind of not a black color, she's more of a chocolate. Looks like you got a little beer for me? <laughs> You gonna guard the floor for any falling food? No. Oh, let's not do that by the grill. She got my shirt. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Magi was here. <laughs> let's not do that again. We'll cook all the burgers a little longer. <laughs> She 
He says, don't worry, Dad. I'm not going to take any. I just want to smell it. Hey, come here. Don't go wander enough. Hey, Jack. Come on. Good girl. Come here. Is anybody out back? No. I'll put her out to the patty. Come here. Come on. Well, I don't know if anybody's going to make it this far into the video, <laughs> but if you did, I hope you enjoyed it. I know we're going to enjoy these burgers. And I hope uh, especially that uh, everybody uh, has a good Memorial Day and that uh, you realize what uh, the real reason for Memorial Day is. Uh, it's not about mattress sales and uh, barbecues it's about uh, remembering those uh, who made the ultimate sacrifice uh, both me and Rob as veterans uh, just want to make sure that everybody uh, that doesn't get lost on you at this point a lot of people died to make it possible for us to uh, live the lives we live over here it's a shame it has to be that way but it is. You can grill because of that. Yeah. We brain cramped bringing the bacon, so it's their egg burgers today. Egg and onion ring burgers. Yep. Which actually sounds pretty damn good to me. <laughs> Hell, I might even put a little bit of my beans on top of that burger. It must be pretty good, actually. Yeah, I'm gonna pick up a smaller version of this thing. My friend has one that's small enough that he keeps it in a semi. Oh, really? And he'll just cook like in the rest of that. Sure. Yep. Yeah, something like that would be nice because I could actually just throw it in the back of my Jeep and then me and Tammy could just go down along the river. And yep. That's actually a good idea. Yeah. Maybe I'll start doing uh, Jeep barbecues. <laughs> Might actually, I know some pretty good spots down along Fort Snelling where you oh, can, yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. We could all go down there with a couple of dogs. Get Pike Island with them. Yeah. Yeah, My permit to park down there is still good. I don't think the display is still dry. This again is for my favorite fan. The guy that said monster is going to kill me.
Take a little break here until we get something else on the grill. So the burgers are done. The buns are toasted. It's just a matter now of making the egg and uh, cheesing up the burgers, right? Yep. Can't wait. Tell Max is uh, hungry. He's uh, came out into the sun now. <laughs> Just a salt and pepper. Nice. You're prepared for everything. And it looks like we're gonna get done right before the storms hit. We uh, supposed to have scattered thunder showers today. Grill's got wheels though, so we can always wheel it inside if it starts early. You know he's getting hungry, he's pacing.
inside there's tomatoes, onions, lettuce. Right. In the kitchen. Onion rings. I'll have to go and get some of those. Yeah. Uh, have to let me uh, get a shot of you eating that thing. Alright. Blue cheese is a melt. Yeah. doesn't like my beans. <laughs> what the hell, huh? Rude. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't like any beans though, so I guess I can't take it too personal. Can you want egg? about to die here. <clears throat> if I lose you, that's why I'll have to switch to my phone. mine. Thank you, brother. You're welcome. Let's go set this up and uh, I'll get back to you when the eating commences. Right there is our sumptuous feast. My gargoyle beans, which are uh, maple and bacon flavored baked beans with uh, really spicy chorizo and uh, lots of spices. It's pretty hot and spicy. My beautiful egg burger. There's Max with his. Rob replicated uh, Burger King's uh, onion ring sauce, and Max said he did a good job with it. It's very good. I liked it a lot. And uh, there's Tammy's. Nice. All right, Max, let us know what you think. You get to be the first one to take a bite. Awesome. Oh, nice. <laughs> Look at that, all that beautiful egg yolk running everywhere. That's the sauce is what makes it good. Super good. Loving it. Here, you can have a in there for you. You got one? Yep, awesome. yep, yep. Let's see what Tammy thinks of hers. Mm. Magi says I want some. Mm. Good? Mm -hmm. Well, let's see, I'm going to have to try here. There she is. So good. Delicious. Mm -hmm. Deplane! Deplane! 
The plane, Mr. Rock. The plane. <laughs> I'm sorry, I couldn't resist. <laughs> if you're from mine and Tammy's age group, uh, you'll remember the show Fantasy Island with uh, Ricardo Montalban. Oh my god, that's good. Mm -hmm. As you can see, being a level 53 Viking, I'm able to eat messy stuff like this without uh, getting a face full of uh, egg yolk and other stuff. <laughs> so good. I'm just enjoying the food. It's really good. Got some of my beans. Alright. So good. So Sauce is good. It does taste like the Burger King sauce. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I'm actually getting full. Yeah, it's a big burger. It really is. It's very thick. I don't talk about it much, but my dogs do get a lot of table scraps too. Medjay. Medjay gets her portion of a burger. What do you think, sweetie? She says, I like that. Good girl. <laughs> I'm struggling. This is filling. Uh, like these last couple of bites are, I don't know if I can do it. You can do it. <laughs> you can do it. <laughs> I have faith in you, Max. I've seen you polish a lot of food. <laughs> right? That's good. What do you think, Mary Jack? She says, where's the rest? <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this. Thanks. Thanks, Thank Steph. You. Thanks, Rob, for everything. It's an awesome Thank burger. Thank you. Good beans. Even Magi enjoyed what she got. See ya. Enjoy your Memorial Day.